The main way that we identified the, the training and skills needs for the staff was through a questionnaire. Every member of teaching staff has to complete the questionnaire when they first start working at the school and it asks them to rate on a confidence scale from one to five how confident they feel in teaching the whole range of ICT skills across the whole of the curriculum. So that it's very much tailored towards the curriculum teaching skills that they need to know. Um, based on that we can identify if there are areas that individuals would need support and training in or if there is a, a need for a whole staff training session on one particular area. Whether it's a training need been identified for staff, we can sort of tackle it in one or two, two different ways. Either if it's a whole staff need, as a staff we can have a whole session where we look at that issue and how we can overcome it. If it's a, sort of either an individual or a small group of people, it can either be tackled in a small group or often, because we work in year group teams here, you often find that there's somebody who can act as an expert within that team group and as part of our PPA team meeting time, there's often the opportunity for someone to share their expertise in ICT to make sure everybody is happy in teaching and delivering that part of the curriculum.